it's here, it's installed, it works, and I'm very happy about it, with it. I love this new stove. If you notice, it's not a uh, glass top. I don't trust myself with glass top. I like to drop things, uh, as you can see in my first video. And I'm always afraid that I'm going to crack the glass and have to buy yet another stove because of it. Because there is no really repairing with one of those. Especially if you crack it and it's still under warranty. That's enough to make anybody cry. So I have, I, uh, I got one of the uh, coils. Okay. And um, we will be utilizing this in the oven in later date and uh, episodes this video is about family traditions every family has a new year's eve tradition staying up playing monopoly or card games pool um in in the south i do believe that the tradition is black eyed peas greens and cornbread with some pork but you saw good, fine and good. That is for something that is for tomorrow. My tradition that I adopted from uh, my first husband's family is menudo. Menudo is a Mexican soup that uh, it consists of what's called tripe. Tripe is the lining of the cow's stomach. Properly cooked is actually pr pretty tasty. Um, it has kind of like a jelly consistency and it's full of collagen, which we are supposed to be eating anyway. So what we're going to go ahead and do is I'm going to go ahead and uh, position the phone to the point to where we can actually see what is going on. It is a very simple soup, but it is very time consuming. It takes about 12 hours. So you want to start this the day before and let it uh, go overnight. I'm going to be doing this in a crock pot. That way I don't have to monitor it uh, on, a, on, 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 like a, on the stove top. You can do it on the stove top. I want to sleep tonight. Okay, so, so whenever you grab a tripe out of the um, store, it comes in a bundle package. It's all wrapped up. Let me get this a little bit more straight. I think that's straight. Okay. What happened is that whenever you open it up, you'll be able to unfold it. It comes in sheets like this, and you want to cut these in about one inch squares. Okay. Um, because they will shrink whenever it's cooked. I'm also going to add an onion. Later on, you want to add a can of hominy. And that's after the this is cooked. Also, you want to get a package of, of menudo spice mix. Okay, this has all the um, spices that you have now. There are other recipes online that actually you make your spices yourself. But you're really good. Don't get me wrong. I just prefer pre-made spice mix. About that size.
out like that. And I'm going to go ahead and finish the rest of this up and throw up the crock pot. Okay, now we are almost done with the onion. Now you want to come about the same size, about an inch to an inch, about that much. And get rid of your scraps. See how full this is? Nice and full. Now what we're going to do is we're going to cover this up with water, put the lid on it, put it on low for about 12 hours, and we will go ahead and let that cook till about 6 o'clock tomorrow morning. It's about 6 o'clock now in the evening, and uh, it will be on low, so it will be a nice warm simmer all night. Whenever we come back in the morning, I'll go ahead and finish putting everything else together. Good morning and Happy New Year's. Now that the uh, tripe has cooked overnight on low, it is now ready for the rest of the ingredients. We're going to go ahead and dump those in. All right. One can hominy drained. Nope. No lid. <clears throat> Preferably rinsed. There's a lot of starch on hominy. And then we're going to go ahead and add our spice packet. You see how deep red that cuts? This is so much better than canned. You know, the, 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 the stuff you buy in the store canned. You can actually can this. Uh, the, it, you process this for meat times, just like you did with the beef and barley uh, soup video that I did. 75 minutes uh, uh, per pound pressure uh, for pints and 90 minutes for quarts. I'm actually going to can some of this up, but it needs to sit a little bit longer. So about an, in another hour, we're going to go ahead and, and do maybe three, maybe two or three jars. And that'll be for later um, use in during the year. Again, you want to leave that one inch head space. Maybe a little bit more on this one. Wipe and put the lids on.
Here it goes. Careful, it's a little warm. Okay, and we're gonna go ahead and just do two, because the rest we're gonna eat. And I'm gonna put these in my tiny and mighty. And we're gonna process these for 75 minutes. All right, now that we're done processing, let's go ahead and take these out. They're still bubbling. That's completely normal. And these will cool overnight before cleaning, labeling, and storage. From our family to yours, I pray that 2022 brings you health, wealth, and happiness for the rest of the year.